Hello there again, Edia friends. Welcome back to my Let's Play of Earth Defense Force Iron Rain. And, um, we are on mission 14 here. Looks like we have new enemies again, Glowing Pincers. It says Quick Team has engaged aggressor forces in the forest area and we've since lost connection with them. In our last transmission, they mentioned being attacked by glowing, scorpion like creatures. It must be a new type of aggressor. Squall Team is on the search, but they've been unable to locate anything in the dark of night. Blast team exterminate this new enemy. Because Squall will be in the area, field support will not be available. Oh, so you can't um, call in vehicles, I guess? Um, so I'm gonna use... Uh, I'm gonna use... Trooper here. And let's see what weapons we wanna take. That rocket launcher wasn't bad. Um, let's see... Missile launcher... We have some new missile launchers haven't used. Two enemies at once, 176 damage. Let's give this a try. <laughs> Thanks, bud. So we'll take that and then we'll take something safer. New shotgun. Eight thousand dollars. Vertical scattering. Scatter shot. Twenty damage times thirty. Equip with a scope. Laser rifle. Let's try this laser rifle. Eighteen hundred dollars. It's a homing laser rifle. Let's give it a try. Right away. Just uh, no return. What's okay. the range on that? Three hundred forty meter range. Well. Wow. All right. Then items. I have five different healers. So <laughs> we'll see if we need all that. I'm really impressed by the variety of the missions. Like Insect Armageddon had just a bunch of cities, from what I remember wasn't too interesting, but this place you're this this mission you're going places and you're constantly in different locations and the lighting's different, the time of day is different. The only thing that's a knock to it really is just the size of the maps. I wish they were a little bit bigger, but I mean especially with six people, I mean are the maps gonna be still the same size, I wonder? I mean that's a lot of people on a little map. This is Squall Leader. Too dark to see, but we have an aggressor signal on the radar. Roger that, Squad Leader. Please continue searching for Quake Squad 6. Roger that. Continuing mission. We lost contact with Squad 6 around here. Yes. We also have aggressor signals. They could have been ambushed. We may be... looking for bodies. Squall is on search. Together. Our mission is to exterminate the enemy. Copy that. Yes, yeah. Okay, yeah, that is funny. We have a lot of shots for that thing, my goodness. Of these things too. Even regular ones have been known to kill humans with their venom, but at this size, I can't imagine. The way they've been acting, it's anyone's guess what they're up to. I want to say this is like 200 damage. Damn, Brenda. According to Dr. Mengel, who analyzed the Gargan carcass, it's possible that it was performing some form of geological research. Geological research? There were many holes over 200 meters deep under Gargan's footprints. 200 meters? We're not sure, but with every step, it looks like it's been stabbing something into the ground. Hmm. We'll have to wait for the doctor's final report then. Aggressor signal approaching. You're surrounded. An ambush? These are the ones that took out squad six. I can't reload this weapon. Is this like a non-reloadable weapon or something? Or does it slowly regen up? Or you put it in the background and it regens? Or... I don't know. I guess I have a good weapon for this. Having homing could be good, yeah? Damn it. Oh, we got big guys now. Same goes for them. Hide yourself as you fight. Who says they have the same vision as us? Tripper is definitely the hardest class to play in. For sure. Yeah, I can lock on twice. That's cool. This is Squall Leader. We've located Squad 6. No survivors. Roger. Log the coordinates and return to base. Oh, 
I like how they're almost all new enemy designs too, like you're not seeing the same drone types and the same... Ravager signal on the radar. It's... enormous! Oh wow, look at that. Okay, so that's a transport ship. What? Three minutes? Oh. You're the best. Please, just hold on for now. Just a little bit longer. Yeah. I thought I had to kill something in three guys. minutes. Like, man, my weapons aren't very strong, you know. I want to know how you reload this thing. I want to shoot it all out and see what happens. Wow, there's more of them. I'm doing damage to it now, it's like. Weapon energy empty. Cannot charge. Oh, so this so that is a one-time use weapon? Is that true? Approaching enemy transport ship! It's even larger than expected. Bigger doesn't mean better. It says can't recharge. Maybe it's use an item to recharge it or something? That's weird. That may not be good. <laughs> I should use a vehicle here. I've had so many vehicles I never use. It looks like the raid ships can release more enemies. Destroy them first. I hope I can figure out how to get that vehicle off the ground this time and not waste it like last time. I'm gonna use my overdrive really quick. Can I now actually go? Okay, hold the board. Okay, now how do I get out? Get up, okay. Oh my goodness, how do I drive this thing? Okay, you hold back. Uh, hold up? Hold down? Hold up? What am I doing? Oh, hold up on the left stick to go higher. And then... Oh my goodness, this thing is so awkward. Until I figure this out. How much health do I have on this thing? I have a lot of health still. Yeah, I, I can't figure this out. Oh my goodness, there's airstrikes. How do I get off this airstrike? Okay, hold on, hold on. Impact confirmed. Calculating damage. I I cannot figure out how to drive this thing. This might be the most difficult thing I've ever driven in my life. So I can roll left and right with me. So this up and down on the left stick is up and down. The right and left turns right and left on the right stick. Kind of confuses how I drive forward. Because I can stand still here. This, this might be the most convoluted thing I've ever driven in my life. Um, do I have other weapons? Oh, I do have bombs. I have grenades to, to 
Damage has reached critical levels. Evacuation recommended. Um, trying to figure out how to drive this thing. Hold on. I guess I kind of get it now a little bit, but I need to eject because I'm gonna kill myself here. Yeah, hold on, hold on. I don't want to get out of the battle area. Yeah, that that was very difficult if you couldn't tell to drive. A little concerned about that. But I kind of want to um, get some of these items. I lost a lot of money from calling that in too, which is a negative thing, but... Poisonous gas detected. Evacuation recommended. Poisonous? What? PA gear online. Poisonous gas? I'm poisoned. Oh, I got poisoned by the scorpions. Cool. Well, there's a big green dot over here. How do I get it off of me? Okay, there we go. It's just time-based. That's a big healing crystal. Look at that. It's a full health for sure. Down, good. Those pincers can almost see the word death tattoo on. Get a few more of these, then I'll I'll end it. I want to get these blue ones because these blue ones are specific. By enemy type, so I think. Zoom. Still confused about that assault chaser. I'm going to read that really quick when I get back, see if I figure out why. If there's a way to reload that, or just period, you cannot reload. It's like a fusion All blaster. All enemies annihilated. Blast. Understood. Good work, everyone. I sure like this map. Time to gather up the gems. 30 seconds? You expect me to gather up gems in 30 seconds? Team Cloud's stuck up attitude really gets on my nerves. Time was bad. Oh, what? It gave me... perfect? Yeah, calling on that vehicle, man, that hurts. Insects have small brains and live off instinct and reflexes. That's why they don't grow attached to humans. But these creatures have developed large brains, so... <laughs> you know, you only sound happy when talking about radios and bugs. New sword. All right, now let's go to Jet Core or Jet One. Um, let's uh, check hey, out the closer. new weapon. What you need? New shotgun. Ten thousand damage. Sparrow precision tracer bullets. Attaches the enemy. Brightly illuminates the target for the team to see. According to EDF. So it allows you to
Large has a lot of amount of vital ultraviolet rays. While too bright for humans to see with the naked eye, the aggressors who have a wider range of vision can be dazed by its flashes. So it stuns enemies, maybe? I guess I'll buy that. It's expensive, but Thanks, I'm trying buddy. it. And then, so the new shotgun, and then... Missile launcher, laser rifle... Oh yeah, the laser rifle. Did it say anything about... Which one did I have? I forgot which one I had. Sky Waltz, it was called. So... Um, which one? Okay, so I have the shotgun, and then... Let me see what that Sky Waltz said. I think it was a laser rifle. Um, no it wasn't. It was something else. Sky Waltz, here it is. Okay, it says... Is this the one that I had? It said reload time dash. No, that's the rocket launcher. That's not it. It's, uh. What was the weapon I had? Oh, assault chaser is called. So that's assault rifle. Where is that at? I can't find the weapon I had before. That I wanted to know if you could, why you can't reload it. Oh, here it is, assault chaser. Cannot reload. Only can be charged at base, okay. And it has many bullets, okay, interesting. So you cannot reload it, even with an item, looks like. Alright, let's take a long range weapon now. We need, I think. I need to launch your sword. Oh, I have a new sword. Short range, though. We'll try that next time. Satellite weapon, assault rifle, shotgun, sniper rifle, rocket launcher. Do I have a good sniper rifle? Not really. The damage seems really low on him. This was a good long range weapon. Let's just go with the rocket launcher, I guess. This one was good. Alright, actually. Let's say cannot be used on this mission. Do you wish to proceed? Oh, the, the you can't have vehicles on that mission. Okay. So scavenging. The, okay, underground. Cool. According to intel from Squall Team, the entire subway complex has been transformed into a nesting ground for the giant creatures. Oddly, the rebellion had been uh, slight sighted carrying large quantities of resources into their blast team. Head over there immediately to find out just what's going on. Since you'll be underground, air support won't be in range. Um. Maybe I should just... I'm going to take the other the other class, the big guy, instead, because that would make more sense. Since I can't fly, so... Rocket launcher's fine. And I'm going to try that uh, shotgun, yeah. Alright, let's begin. Do you guys like uh, active reloads, or do you dislike them? I feel like it's very, uh, it's very, what is the word I'm thinking of? Polarizing. Either people really like it this or really dislike it. Copy? According to Squall's recon, this entire abandoned subway system is a nest for the giant creatures. An ant nest, if I ever saw one. Also, we have intel that the Rebellion has been transporting large amounts of resources. What are they up to? We're hoping to find out from you. Oh my goodness. What's the reload on this? What in the world is the reload? I mean, you can reload in the background, sure, but... My goodness, it's like 10 seconds or more. Looks good, the lighting. I mean, I guess we'll have to try and make it work, but... Hmm. Crazy to think that trains used to run through here every day. And now it's just ants scuttling around. I'm detecting motor sounds from below, albeit faintly. We found a rift. Going in to investigate. Roger. Be careful. Ooh, who put that there? 
I could go this way. Ugh, creepy. Ladies first, Brenda. Oh, so you're electing yourself? Mm. It's the only way to go. Very narrow. No melee, but. Captain, there's light. Yeah, be careful. There was light. What the? Hey, look! The giant creatures! They aren't attacking! Mm. Are they controlling them? They're raising giant creatures? Raising aggressors? Not on my watch, they ain't! Mike, wait! Oh, it's the Riders. So we're gonna be friend one of the guys. What's the EDF doing here? Pfizer! It's them! It's the EDF! Cool it, Mike! Brenda, cover Mike! We're out of options! They're falling back! Get over here, Rebels! Whoa. So this is like... Oh my goodness. Damn it. Trying to give me a heart attack what was that? <laughs> I'm driving away. This behavior will put us all in danger. I'm sorry, sir. They're not here to cover your rear. Oh my goodness, I need to quit I need to quit hurting myself. Let's just hold my shield up. Raising aggressors to harvest energy gems more efficiently, I'd assume. That so what does this thing do? Looked like it was controlling the giant creatures. Oh, they went this through is the trouble of creating cool. those just for collecting gems. Does it stun them or what does it do? Anything to them? Seems like it's stunning them or something. Oh, it's hard to tell. I'm gonna, try, I'm gonna try that weapon again on the next set of guys and see what happens. Bad news. Blast leader. Quake team also ran to the rebellion above ground. We can't hear you. It looks like we're locked in. The rebellion went in deeper. There may be another exit. Doesn't seem like that does anything really to them. Yeah, I do like how you can shoot explosives near yourself with this guy. I do like that concept. Rip. Oh, rip. Rip. So does that use more energy? Let me hold my shield up and shoot myself and see if it uses more of my shield. Looks like it does use like it uses the burst of your shield when you get hit, but still pretty nice. Choices, I don't like choices. Maybe I shouldn't shoot the enemy with this light, I should shoot like the ground or something. Because when the enemy disappears or dies, then it disappears. Maeve. Maeve, do you copy? Communications out. Yeah. 
Our only option is to keep moving. Stuff you can destroy to get gems. It's nice to know. Like, does this stuff give you gems too? No. Whoa. <laughs> that was a big gem? Or is it a big gem? Yeah, this is a huge gem. My goodness. What's over here? I guess. Watch your footing. Are we going underground or down this hole now? Yeah, it's gotta be. Watch your feet. Uh oh. Got eggs here. Ooh, those are health gems. Yeah, this stuff gives you items. It's 192 blue, that's pretty big. Wow. Oh no, I guess it's 192. It's 192 total. Okay. Well, we'll probably have to go the other way, I'm assuming. Ooh, orange in that crate. Kinda reminds me a little bit of Lost Planet, where you have to, um, try to get resources. And you destroy, like, equipment and stuff to get heat or whatever you had then in that game. Recharging energy. a good rocket launcher for sure. tell if this is a good weapon or what. It seems like it kills whatever it hits, but... I don't know. I'll have to read the description again. Health. Don't need health.
I brought the right weapon because, <laughs> my goodness, explosives are good down here for sure. Easily they are in the ground though. It's like a crates over here to, to pick up. Sorry, I know, I should probably stop doing that to you. Alright, what did we get? Guardian? I can't really carry it, I guess, is the thing. Looks like we're going into a nest here. This is probably Look not going to end well. Let's keep moving, closer. Well, that's, uh, are we going down here? I guess we're going down here. Oh, wow. Cool. The giant creatures queens? The rebellion is being attacked too. I think I took the right. Yeah, I think I took the right. Uh, class here. We need again, Should probably be my overcharge now. Talk later. Yep, unlimited shield, quick, quick, uh, rockets. Oh my goodness. Wow, that was very strong. I can't get the stuff! Move the body! Are you seriously gonna block this? Okay, thank you. Blast leader! Blast leader! <sighs> We've re-established communications. We have your current location. We'll guide you to the exit. That's what they should do with Please bosses. Navigate. They should just lock you into an arena, like with the Nerf Defense Force as well. We have you to thank for that mess, Mike. I want to see the sun again. See, I thought you would be just fine. Just health, okay. We made it back. Yeah, having that overcharge there really helped. I like the way that lighting looks. Crazy here, crazy here. Thirteen minutes. All right, ten thousand dollars. Not too bad. Looks like we can do another mission. Examine the unique PA gear that oh. controlled the giant creatures in the Rebellion's underground facilities. We reverse engineered the technology and successfully implemented it into our own gear. However, controlling giant creatures requires a lot of power. When it comes to practical use, it oh, will wow, only that. function when overdrive activates. Oh, you do it during overdrive? Okay, so Prowl Rider. Assault Rifle, Laser Rifle, Enhanced Nightcrawler, um, Prowl Rider Headgear. Um, so we're gonna have a new, uh, a new class. So let's, uh, let's copy this one to four. And then select four, and then change our equipment to Prowl Rider. Okay, the gear stands above the others with the astonishing mobility of its wire-powered E-needle ability, and the ability that you can use during overcharge to deploy a giant creature. However, the experience of a truly seasoned soldier is essential in order to effectively control the oft erratic E-needle. Low defense. Alright, good item capacity. Let's try this one. And then, let's Yo, see what we got. How's your finances going? Can we get a new weapon? Yeah, we got a new machine gun. We'll try it. Cost 8,000. <laughs> equip bud. that. And then let's equip anything else new. Got a new laser rifle, this one. The chameleon. 31 damage times 15 shots. Bullets adjust by charging. We'll have to try that too. How much did that cost? Two thousand. That's cheap. Right away. Just uh, no returns, okay? Okay, so 
the Prowl Rider allows you to equip the enemy you want. Interesting. So this is Fang Thrust, Acid Blast, can walk on walls, Web Thrower, release babies, and jumps. Pincer Attack, Venom Spray, can destroy buildings. Let's just start with the ant, I guess. And then items, it's fine. Haven't been using items too much, but uh... Alright, rescue mission. We've gotten backup requests from the f tank fleet deployed on the high rise area. The fleet was forced to split into three groups after being attacked by aggressors and currently are pinned to a standstill. Blast team going for immediate assistance. The prowl rider's e gears e will be perfect to maneuver through this area. Recommend heading to submission with the prowl rider. Okay, give us a try. Let me go to options really quick and increase the sensitivity by a little bit. Okay. So their ability kind of like the dash for a trooper, I guess, is the E-needle. Let's see how this works. The G-Liar. Conserve energy with the E-needle. When using the Prowler as E-needle bit, you have to gain momentum of conserve energy by releasing the wire and letting energy carry you. Okay, so you, it's just a, made a percentage bar rather than a single one out of five use or something. This could be fun. Okay, so yeah, it is a percentage. Okay, cool. Your goal this mission is to support the other teams. The teams dispatched to this area are surrounded by enemies. Damn, close it! Straight out of a comic book! Cool. Another feature of the Prowl Rider. Oh, and you Use can climb on the building? That's cool. You actually can grab on the side of the building, too. Can you just jump onto a building and climb? No. So you can still sprint. Oh, you can even do a faster sprint. My goodness. They're very fast. Yeah, this could be very fun if you get good at it. For sure. So you press it once and press it again to let go. And it allows you to stick to a building if you want. Well, and you eventually slide off and then you can jump off no. them. We've gotta do something. That's cool. I like that. This could be very high. The target um, is the yellow marker on the radar. High skill though to use. Let's see what this weapon does. Charge it up. Oh, it's like a shotgun otherwise. It's explosive though. Wow, this thing looks cool. Reload isn't bad. Looks like you've gotten used to your new gear. Oh, you can actually see. lock onto the the ants too. I don't want to do that though. Thank you, Blast Team! So you can lock into the ground too to get further away. I like this weapon though. So the second charge, the third charge doesn't blow up buildings. The second charge does. And the first charge, it's like a shotgun. That's, that's very cool. Very unique kind of like weapon. Very unique weapon. I like it. We'll have to use overcharge and try it out. I'm gonna try over over overcharge now. <laughs> Why can't I do it? That's right. The giant creature's unique pheromone combined with Where's... neuropulse. Where's my? Oh, it's right here. Is that thing safe? How do I get on it? Oh. Oh. Do I keep it forever then? After I use it once, I can shoot acid. With the booty, the booty swing, the booty swing. This thing's pretty good. Do I have health for this thing? It's very strong. striking 
Okay, overdrive's about out. I wonder if you keep it, or it's probably done once you're done with overdrive, I imagine. Yeah, okay. Figure as much. That's pretty cool, though. I like that. It's very unique. So you slide down once you wait long enough. I like this. This is actually probably faster than Wing Diver. Cool. The only one on the radar is the target. We got the short end of the stick here. That's pretty fun. Somebody do something. There's a tank there. I wonder if I can drive that. Or I probably need to protect it. Team found. Now let's My goodness, that thing is awesome. Found our friends. They're surrounded by enemies. I'm getting real sick. This sprint is very good too. Very good sprint. My goodness. Enemies and save that team. This is probably more fun than the Jet Rider, my goodness, I like it. Very good. This might be my favorite weapon so far though, it's so good. I love the second shot, like and then it's even a sniper rifle if you, um... So you can quick turn by, uh, by holding back and just tapping sprint. Okay, I need to remember that, because that's a pretty useful thing. I can see being a sword being kind of good here, with, uh, getting close to the enemy and then... These are new ant types, looks like. Whoa, that was cool. What was that? Oh, these can bite you. How did I slide on the ground? I wanted to try that again. Can I drive this bus? I can. It's a horn. You drive with the left stick only though, unfortunately. I like I guess that's not bad, but Can I run these things over, I wonder? You can, okay. So it does do damage. Changing the course of battle like that. This is a nice longer mission. There's just one left. Hurry up and take out the surrounding enemy. Boss team! Pure sight for sore eyes. My goodness, I love this weapon. It's 
That's a lot of dudes. So looks like you only do get overdrive once per mission. <laughs> so fun. Warning, cylinder nodes are high. Even as a shotgun, this thing's pretty cool when they're close. I mean, you waste kind of you kind of waste your shots on that because it's a long reload, but I do like it. Man, this weapon is so good. I want to know the blast radius on this because it feels like it's 20 meters or something. Plus, it looks good. That's always important. What do those reds do? Get some health Let's here. Let's lose some health here. You want to take a break, Brenda? Come on, at least pretend to worry. Warning, server motor loads are high. What if you can grab gems with this? No, it just pulls you to it. Yeah, you get body blocks in this game a lot more than other ones. The other one. Okay, you get on top of a roof. That's cool. At this, at this particular class would be very, very fun. I love it. I love it. What am I supposed to do here? I'll protect this. It probably is a lot more forgiving than normal. Because <laughs> I wasn't been doing anything like that. I haven't been protecting anything I'm supposed to protect. I'm just messing around, having fun. This weapon reloaded. We're clearing out ants today. Let's do this. Cool. Fun. Good swimmers die in rivers. Overconfidence and carelessness are most you dangerous. Can just in on the ground a bunch over and over again. Last team, headed to up. run along the ground. That's cool. I like that. Hey, 
Wow, I mean, Ranger I could see them in. making a game just based on the movement of this class alone, let alone have other classes in the game. Very, very, very cool. They did a good job. A... 9k, baby. I'm staying around 100k the whole time. So if I didn't have the extra 100k from the deluxe bonus, I would have always been in the, the negative. So, or not the negative, I'd always be at zero this pretty much. With how I'm unlocking stuff, Network. so it's kind of Gideon, nice bonus. leader of the terrorist organization Kindred Rebellion, has made a statement addressing the EDF. In the statement, he strongly criticizes the EDF's attack on the Rebellion underground facility and has threatened retaliation for it. We don't have the details, but according to a reliable source, the EDF attacked a Rebellion facility built in the abandoned subway tracks under areas C-15 through 20, and there were many casualties on both sides. We will broadcast any new information as it comes in. Universal News Network, signing off. They're gonna retaliate, they say. Bring it on! I'll knock them down any day of the week! But Captain, I wonder what their motives are. Hmm, never thought they'd be raising aggressors. See if I got anything new really quickly here. Recruits, this is new. I like that. That's pretty good. See if I got anything else new. No, I'm gonna use those pants. I really like those pants. These things right here, I think that looks really good. It doesn't match necessarily, but I like the way it looks. That green's kind of nice. I like the red and black here. I like that too, but it's not as... I'm gonna try this, see how it looks. And then... Upper body, anything new here? Yeah, that's, that's a new suit, I think. Yeah, there's some good... There's some good, uh... Some good outfits. I'll stick with what I have. Lower body. Oh, that's right, I already changed the lower body. No, I thought I changed it. Why didn't it... Why didn't it change? Oh, because I have to buy it? Oops, I meant, uh... Lower body. Oh, it's locked. Attain 30 lower body outfits. Oh, buy 30 lower body outfits before you can unlock. Okay, cool. I like I like that. It's something to look forward to to, to unlock. All right. Well, cool. Yeah, we'll end it there. Um, so so yeah, really exciting. Oh, I love that PA. I love that gear. The the rider, whatever it's called. So. So yeah, thanks a lot for watching and uh, continuing with me on this. Hope you have get to the end with me. Um, so yeah, thanks a lot for watching. Remember, Eve doesn't leave a man behind, ever. And if you're interested in ways to support the channel, please consider um, joining with the uh, link in the description or through the join button or uh, sharing the channel with someone as it does help financially. It's very much appreciated. Thanks a lot.